Hey, what's up, you amazing hackers? Hope you're all doing well today. Welcome back to the channel. I found this amazing article on Medium and I thought I'd read it for you for some evening entertainment. I received a bounty of $60 for finding a critical bug in the patient management system. That's kind of a disgrace. Hi, hackers. My name is, I'm sorry, Krishnadev, if I pronounced that incorrectly. To know more about me, just search who is Krishnadev on google or ask your google assistant so in my ongoing efforts to enhance the security landscape of web applications i recently discovered a critical vulnerability on a healthcare platform good on you dude let's discover what that is this vulnerability which i reported on july 3rd 2023 could potentially lead to an account takeover while posing a significant risk to patient privacy data. That is a big one, of course, because in Europe especially, and I think in America as well, you have GDPR in Europe. I don't know what the American proponent of that is, but you have laws that really protect against this, or should at least. And of course, if leakage occurs, that is a huge problem for these companies, which is why $60, that is a big no no in my opinion they should at least give you a proper reward because you saved them a hell of a lot of money we will see in this article as well that this is an actual valid bug so in this write-up i aim to outline the details of the vulnerability while maintaining the confidentiality of the platform that's always great you should always do that you should blur out any identifiable details such as for example the platform the website etc all right, so what we have here is a account takeover with the impact level of critical risk patient account takeover leading to sensitive data loss and the priority of P1. The steps to reproduce the vulnerability are to visit the platform, and I'm sorry about that, and navigate to the relevant login section. Then you need to click on forgot password and you need to enter a valid phone number of another patient, which is not hugely difficult to get that is already registered as a user on that platform then you need to enter the valid attacker's one-time password and click on submit so you get yourself a one-time password and you use it on somebody else's phone number and you use that your one-time password to reset their password and get a new one this is of course a big big problem because these one-time passwords should always be bound to your mobile phone number we'll see the request a bit as well below is an example of that request which exposes the vulnerability please note that the specific details and target information have been redacted to ensure responsible disclosure good on you dude and as we can see here the mobile is redacted that is of the victim we have the passcode or the one-time password i should say we have a new password and a confirmation of that new password and of course this code isn't bound to this mobile number you can use a valid code on any existing mobile number great find dude really great find by exploiting this vulnerability an attacker can bypass proper authentication on the platform the vulnerability stems for improper validation of the mobile parameter allowing an attacker to reset the password of any user account by modifying the request this could result in unauthorized access to sensitive user information including personal and private data I reported it to the affected organization and they triaged my report in minimum time and rewarded me with a bounty of $60. Don't forget to follow me on Medium and other social media. Also, please give your 50 claps for this write-up and that's my inspiration to write more. I think the very least we can do for our amazing hacker Krishnadev is give him a clap and as you can see i already did that and i urge you to do the same i'm going to put all of his socials in the description below and i'll also put a link to the article thank you very much for watching it's a disgrace this amazing hacker only got 60 euros so the very least we can do for him is give him those 50 claps thank you very much amazing hackers i'll see you in the next one 